Many newer technologies really try to push the boundaries of what can be done and bring the world something that it's never seen before. But sometimes, some of the most useful stuff can just be a rehash of something that's actually very old, sometimes thousands of years old, as is the case with electronic ink. Although we've had paper and ink for a millennia and can read just about anything we want on smartphones or tablets, e-readers that use electronic ink or e-ink instead of fully fledged LCD screens are a very popular choice. But Luke! Why do people even buy these things? I mean, your Android or iOS device can display eBooks just fine. So what's the point? Well, to understand the advantages e-ink devices have, it helps to know a little bit about how they work. A standard black and white e-ink display is made up of millions of very small spheres called microcapsules and are filled with black and white particles of pigment suspended in a fluid. White particles carry a positive electrical charge while black ones carry a negative charge. When you want to display something like that copy of Fifty Shades that you only read after everyone's gone to bed, your e-reader applies different electrical fields to each microcapsule, which in turn makes either the white or black particles rise to the top, creating text or an image. E-readers can also apply different charges to different sides of a single microcapsule, giving capsules a half white, half black, or gray appearance, which can be very useful in increasing resolution by giving the edges to letters and other objects a smoother look. The nice thing about this ink suspended in goop system is that once the ink is pushed to the top, it stays there without needing any kind of power input. The display only draws power when you have to change something on the screen, such as going to the next page, because simply leaving a page on the screen while you're reading it uses no power, unlike an LCD display. Battery life for e-readers is often measured in like days or even weeks instead of hours. The downside to this, of course, is just like with real paper, you'll need some sort of external light so you can actually read what's on the page. Some e-readers, like the popular Amazon Kindle Paperwhite, have included built-in LED lights for reading after dark, which works with a light guide to direct light evenly across the screen so that it's easy for your eyes and convenient, but also harder on your battery. Even so, the need for a light source is a worthwhile trade-off for people who want easy portability, less eye strain than a typical LCD screen, and the same awesome viewing angles you'd get from a gas station paperback. And if you want to do more than just read in black and white, there's even color e-ink technology that uses other color pigment particles and additional electrodes or color filters on top of the display, though it hasn't achieved widespread adoption in the consumer market yet. Thanks to its ability to hold images for a long time without using electricity, electronic ink is starting to find its application in other things other than just e-readers, even flash drives with external e-ink displays that uh, are able to display how much capacity is still left inside. E-ink smartwatches that don't need to be charged nearly as often as an Apple Watch or say Galaxy Gear. There are lots of cool concepts that may become a reality as well, such as e-ink credit cards that show your balance on the card in real time, and even large-scale displays that can even change the appearance of walls or furniture. Pretty cool. Maybe one day you'll have an electronic ink couch that can display scenes from your favorite comics, but quickly switch off when it's time to bring a date over. <laughs> Speaking of switching quickly, TunnelBear is a VPN that lets you tunnel to 20 different countries, allowing you to browse the internet and use online services as if you're in a different country. They have easy to use apps for iOS, Android, PC, and Mac, and also have a Chrome extension. Just choose the country in the app, turn TunnelBear on, and watch as your bear tunnels your internet connection to your new location. When you turn tunnel bar on, two things happen. Your connection gets encrypted with AES-256 bit encryption, and your public IP address gets switched, so you can show up as if you're in a different country. TunnelBear lets you bypass all the annoying details that typically come by using a VPN for personal use. There's no need to mess around with port configurations, DNS, or any of the other annoying setting. TunnelBear handles, handles, handles all of that for you, like a TunnelBear would. And they also have a top-rated privacy policy. So check out TunnelBear.com with 500 megabytes free data, no credit card required. And if you want to upgrade to unlimited data, you can do so and save 10%. Check out the link in the video description down below or go to TunnelBear.com Linus. 
Like the video if you liked it, dislike it if you disliked it. Don't forget to subscribe down below. Also check out Channel Super Fun over there. It's always, it's cool stuff. We're doing some pretty cool things later this week. I can't tell you about it though. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, down below in the comments, if there's something you'd like to see us cover here on Channel Super Fun, tell us there. If there's something you'd like us to do, I mean here on Tech Quickie, there we go. If there's something you'd want us to do on Channel Super Fun, go over there, comment on that channel. Yeah. Anyways, don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.